Hello everyone, it's my channel. Today we're doing reading for sign of Leo. Keep in mind that this will not resonate for every Leo. So let's see what we have for the sign of Leo. All right, and if you'd like a personal reading, that is going to be in the description down below. It'll be open until the 7th, and after the 7th, there'll be no more opens for personal readings. All right, so I wanted to say Aries. Maybe you have those placements on your chart, one around you, but either way. Leo, let us see what we have for you. Leo. We have the Queen of Coins, all right? And with this card, it's Earth. So we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. To get those placements in your chart, or maybe one around you, all right? But look at this. We have what appears to be like your uh, third eye chakra here, shining bright. So your third eye is open here, but you're also connected with the Earth. You're also grounding here, Leo, all right? And you're also appearing as financially stable, financially abundant. We have the Sun. Okay, and we have all the planets lining up for you, Leo. Now, on the top of this, we also have Sagittarius, we have Libra, and we have Aquarius. So you could have those placements in your chart, maybe one of those signs around you. But the thing is, everything's lining up for you. That's the important part. Two of Cups, we have some sort of love, Leo. Look at this. There's some sort of love or coming your way. It can be an Earth sign, Sagittarius, Libra, or Aquarius. And we have the Devil. Oh, goodness. You have Capricorn. E. I don't really like that card. We have the Queen of Swords. We have Air. We have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You have those placements in your chart. Maybe one around you. Here. We have a Chariot. Now we have Cancer, the Zodiac sign. I feel like you're ascending here. Uh, Leo. You're getting away from the devil here. And you're sending upwards here. You're sending upwards towards the sun. You know, like higher vibrations. We have the emperor. Remember when I was talking about Aries? Look at this. Now we have Aries here. We have the moon. All right? So there may have been something you may have manifested here with the last full moon, which was Aries full moon. Think back to what that was, and I feel like that is manifesting for you. But with the moon card here, we also have Thoth, and we have Anubis that you're connecting with. Leo, those are the deities you're connecting with here. All right, those are the deities you're moving towards to, I feel like, co-create, right? I do feel like you do have love coming your way as well. Like I said, with these, these three signs here. You know, Sagittarius, Libra, Aquarius. Now, I do feel like there also could be Capricorn coming your way, but I don't honestly really avoid that because it's like a very suppressive type of person and obsessive and controlling. So, we have the Ace of Swords. You see that? We're moving up towards the heavens, Leo, with the sky, with the eagles. The eagles represent great spirit, the creator. All right. We have the Eight of Coins here. So maybe something that you're planning, uh, Leo, you're planning something, or you're getting messages. We have the Ace of Wands. Now we have Passion. We're connecting with the Dragon Spirit, which is power. We have the Fool. We have a Fool coming your way. It's right above the Devil. So we have a Fool coming your way. Honestly, ooh. You really need to raise your vibration, Leo. Raise your vibration because you have someone here coming your way, all right? But they're appearing as the fool, the devil. You have the world, all right? Remember when I said everything is lining up for you? Everything is lining up for you, Leo, all right? Everything. You have a three of cups. Maybe you do something here with music. So we have uh, the musical instruments here. See that? We have judgment. Yeah, you see, rising up towards the heavens. See when I was talking about that? Raising your vibrations up towards the heavens. What you can do, you can listen to meditation music for that, actually, Leo, which would really help you. Rising towards your angels. Getting away from the devil here. We have a three of wands. See, that's a ship coming in. Oh, I know when I was talking about music. 
Yeah, I was just talking about that before I pulled that card. I feel like music is really good. It's going to help you raise your vibration here, Leo. It's going to help you vibrate, raise your vibration towards the heavens. Leo, this is this ship coming in for you. You have the three of coins. You see, there's something you're hard at work at. Something in your craft. You have the ace of coins. There's new beginnings here, I feel like, for money. You have the seven of cups. At this moment, is there anything that you can choose to do? Six of swords. You see that? There's this boat. This is the boat that came in from heavens. Now, you're getting in the boat, and you're moving forward. And the five of wands. You have some people that are... Drama. You have justice. You have divine justice coming in. I feel like there's a divine intervention because when I look at this card, it says people are they're like demons. You see that? They're like demons. So that's why there's a divine intervention. It's to kind of like make these people fall away, fall out, fall out of the light. All right. You have the page of cups. All right. Page of coins. We have two young people here. It's going to represent children, your children, or children around you. All right. So, Leo, that is all I have for you. If you want to see more content for your site, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Bye, guys.